And here is a superstar who is unquestionably one of the greatest big men in the history of WWE, Yokozuna. Not a lot to say about Yokozuna that hasn't already been said. One of the most versatile heavyweights in the history of our business. A man who knows how to balance size and agility. I completely agree. And underestimating Yokozuna's athleticism would be a huge mistake. And across the ring, we've got Angel Garza, a man who certainly thinks the world of himself. As he should. Garza has it all. World-class athletics. Oh, he's got him covered. He kicks out before two. Way too early. Ah. Uh, Crank in the head. Yokozuna gets countered. He's turning the tables. And Garza reverses. Ouch. Next, setting up. Oh, basement drop kick into the car. One, two, and he kicks out at two. Couldn't quite slam the door yet. Double underhook up and. Of mine. I thought he was unconscious. How draining was that? Can it be done again? Can that maneuver be summoned at least one more time? That's the kind of athleticism opponents do. Now look at that. Pancakes. Guards is down and out. Two. What? Only two? Well, I thought that was game over. Pure guts to kick out there. You got to imagine this match has a different complexion after what we just saw. Just cranking ahead. Yoko soon against reversed. Both knees into the face. Garza now looking to go high risk. He's positioning himself, closing in. From the top rope.